students myself ayushita i welcome you on envira online school today we will start our next chapter for class 4 chapter number 2 name of this chapter is number system in this we learn about numbers more about numbers so we learned in our previous class four digit numbers we learn about four digit number so which is the largest four digit number largest four digit number is 9999 this is the largest four digit number now let's make the five digit number from this so what comes after 9999 So here, let's add one to find the after number. So add one. So nine plus one is nine plus one is ten. So here is zero, and this is one. Then nine plus one ten zero here and one carry over. Now nine plus one ten. So zero here and one carry over. Next nine plus one is ten. So now what we get? We get a five digit number, which is the ten one zero zero zero. This is the smallest. Five digit number. This is the smallest five digit number. Next, next is the largest five digit number is largest five digit number is nine 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 nine. This is the largest five digit number now from this let's find out the smallest six digit number so what what we are doing let's add one in this largest five digit number and get the smallest six digit number so now Nine plus one, ten. Zero here and one. Carry over. Next, nine plus one, ten. So zero here and one. Carry over. Next, nine plus one, ten. Zero here and one. Carry over. Nine plus one, ten. Zero here and one. Carry over. Next. Nine plus one is ten. So one, two, three, four, five, six. This is a six-digit number. The smallest six-digit number. So now we have five-digit number and six-digit number. Let's read. Let's find how to read these numbers with a place chart. We learn about all the numbers with place chart. Now let's learn five digit numbers with a place chart. So look at the board. This is the place chart. So let's find out the place value of these. So start from this is this. What is this place called? This is the ones place. This is ones place. After this, this is called the tens place. Next is hundred, and next is thousand. So this we learned in our previous class. Now this is the four digit. Now what is called the fifth digit? This is Ten thousand. This is 
called ten thousand. And the next place is called lakh. The next place is called the lakh. And this is called the ten lakh. Ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and then ten lakh. So here we have the place value of a seven digit number. This number has seven digits. One, two, three, four, five, six, and Seven. So this is the place value for a seven-digit number. Start from ones, then tens, hundreds, thousand, ten thousand, lakh, and then ten lakh. Now let's classify this place chart. So first, first three places make one sphere. So this is ones. This is called the ones period. Now these two, these two places makes thousands period. This is called thousand. Now next is these two places make the lakhs period. This is. Lakhs. These three are called ones, then thousands, and then lakhs. So we are classifying these in periods. Now let's learn about international value, international place value for digits. Let's learn about international place value. Let's start. So this is start from ones, then tens, then hundred, then thousand, and then ten thousand. International Indian same from for that. Now next is hundred thousand. This is called the hundred thousand. Next. Is called million. Next is called million. Next is ten million. Next is called ten million. Now, last is called the hundred million. Once, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. Both are same. Now, change from here. Hundred thousand, million, ten million, and then the hundred million. Now, just like we classify these in periods, let's classify them also. So, the first three are makes one period. This is makes one period. Then one, two, three. These three makes the thousand period. This is makes thousand period. Next one, two, three. These three places make the million million period. So here we also classifying this in periods. First three this makes ones, then three makes thousand and then the millions now understand these to take and to understand these take an example so example so here we have a number 1 3 6 7 8 5 so how many digits 1 2 3 4 5 this is a five digit number so let's read this and let's 
learn how to use comma. Let's start. First, place value chart. Place value chart. Arrange these numbers in place value chart. So first, this is 5, then 4, 6, 3 and 1. So place value, 1's, 10's, Hundred, thousand, and then ten thousand. So here ones, tens, hundred, and thousand. So this we know how to read this. This is three thousand six hundred forty-five. Now we have one more number, which is ten thousand. So this is a tens place. Tens. So this is tens, one tens. So one tens and three ones. So what it makes? It makes thirteen. It makes thirteen. So let's read them together. This is thirteen thousand. This is called thirteen thousand. And we use comma after the thousand. So this is how to read this. Thirteen thousand six hundred forty-five. How can we read this number? This is thirteen thousand six hundred forty-five. So here we learn about how to read a five-digit number. Let's take one more example. Three. Nine zero eight seven. This is also five digit number. So this is the ones, tens, hundred, thousand, and ten thousand. This is the tens. So this is thirty. Then thirty nine. This is called thirty nine. And we use comma after the thousand. So here we are using the comma. So this is thirty nine, and the what make this period? This is thousand. So this is thirty nine thousand, and zero one hundred place. And next is eighty seven. So thirty nine thousand eighty seven. Understand? Let's take one more example. Let's take one more example. One zero five six seven four. So how many is it? One two three four five six. This is a six digit number. So let's write the place value. This is ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. And then, yes, this place is called lakh. So let's learn how to read this. So start from here. This is lakh. So let's start with here. This is one lakh. The period is changed. So when period is changed, we use the comma. So one lakh, and then zero or ten place, ten thousand place, zero. So zero is not reading. Then five. So comma after thousand. So one lakh five thousand six hundred seventy four. This is one lakh five thousand six hundred seventy four. Let's take more examples. One three seven zero six five four. So how many digits? One two three four five six seven. A oh, seven digit number. Let's write the place value. So ones, tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand, lakh. And ten lakh, right? So this is the lakh lakh period. So let's 
comma. Then this is a thousand. So here we use the comma. So let's read this. So this is the tens. Tens. One tens is ten. And three. So ten plus three is thirty. So this is called thirty. So thirty lakh period. So thirty lakh. Next seventy. Seven zero seventy. And this is the thousands period. So thirteen lakh seventy thousand six hundred fifty four. So how can we read this number? This is thirteen lakh seventy thousand six hundred fifty four. So here we learn how to read the number according to Indian and place value chart. Now let's learn how to learn how to read these number according to international place value chart. Let's start with these example. So the first example is one, three, six, four, five. So here we are learn about the internet according to the international place value chart. So this is one. Then tens, hundred, thousand, and ten thousand. This is the same, same. So the comma use here. Thirteen thousand six hundred forty-five. This is this remain the same. The five-digit number remain the same in India and international. Now, next is. Next is also five digit number. This is the same. Next, this example. So let's take this example here. What is this? One zero five six seven four. So place value. Ones, tens, hundred, thousand. And then the hundred thousand. So now use the comma. Use comma for a period. So this is the thousand period in international place value. So this is comma we use here, and this is the one period. So we use comma. So now let's read this. So this is. Hundreds, so hundred is one hundred, and then five. So this is called one hundred five thousand. One hundred five thousand six hundred seventy four. One hundred five thousand six hundred seventy four in international. In India, we learn about. We learn one lakh five thousand six hundred seventy four in international. We read one hundred five thousand six hundred seventy four. So here we learn about the international place value and also we learn about the Indian place value. How to read the digits five digit number. And six digit number in both, and we learn about use the comma also. We learn many more things about this in our next part. So here this part is completed. So let do practice at your home for 